This is how the machine will be set up. Your weighing table will be underneath the screw conveyor and this blue pipe must be uh, loose fitting in there, not touching any of the sides. To set up the machine, you will plug it in to normal 220 volt mains power. You will plug in the motor cable that comes from the top of the motor, runs down the auger, comes up, you will plug it in there. You will plug in your compressor um, hose and the machine works with air. It will need at least five bars of pressure. And also the hose for the pneumatic hammer will plug in there and the other end will be into this fitting that will give a to the pneumatic vibrating hammer at the back. You can also set how hard and how fast it must uh, hit with this little adjuster knob. The machine has an on switch which you can activate then everything will switch on inside. To clamp a bag make sure that the bag is between these two clamps it must be between there and also between those two. You will press this little wheel, it will open, it will clamp the bag, the screw conveyor will start turning. As you see, it will start filling the bag as the bag gets weight. On the first set point, it will slow down and then on the second set point it will stop once it has stopped you can release the bag it can be taken away and the next bag can be placed and the machine will run again on top of the machine we find a run a stop and emergency stop the run will activate the machine uh, that is in case this little sensor breaks uh, there is a second way to start the machine while you wait for replacement uh, switching uh, press an old print until you see L uh, SP1 then you enter there that's the first set point use the arrows left to move left up to change the value and when you are finished, you can just press the F1 enter and that is selected. Press F3 to go to SP2 for the second set point. Same, F1 to enter. Use the arrows to move around and uh, select your, your value. F1 when you're finished. When you're finished again, just press F3 until you get exit. You can even hold it in. When you hit exit, press F1 and you will be back to your menu. To calibrate, press and hold the print button. It will show you SP1. Use F3 to move up until you find LC config. Enter there with the F1 key. Go up until you find LC Cal for our, our load cell calibration. Press F1 to enter there. Your display low will be all zeros. Your display high, uh, we set it up with 13. You can choose your calibration weight uh, that you, your known weight to put in there. Select, um, use the arrow keys to move around and change the values. We use 13, then you press enter the F1 key, um, you go up and up and up again until you get weight, you press the F1 to enter, you press 1 again, you uh, make sure that there is nothing on the, on the scale, you will press F1 again and then you will press it once more, it will start a countdown, when it is done, you will uh, be in this menu then you just uh, go up again press f1 again there is your weight 
for the calibration. You will put your weight there on the, on the platform. You will then uh, press F1 and then press F1 again. It will start the countdown. When the countdown is done, you will just be able to press uh, print to go back. Then you press it again to go back and again to go back until you are in LCCFG. Then you just press the F3 button to go to exit and it will be calibrated.